Well, the first thing that Washington can do to improve our economy is get out of the way. Currently, Washington, D.C. has a tone where they're over-regulating, over-taxing small businesses, which we've seen in evidence from issues like the Affordable Care Act, which is crippling small businesses and deterring them from growing and hiring more full-time employees. Not to mention the fact that we're struggling with a $19.2 trillion debt. That's $60,000 for each and every American. That is not a burden that we should be leaving to future generations. It's time for Washington, D.C. to sharpen their pencils and create more, uh, a more fiscally responsible budgeting process and get the American economy going again. Well, Congress can do a lot to improve the economy, and one of the first things they can do is invest in our infrastructure, roads, bridges, highways. Those are all jobs that are right here at home, and I'm particularly proud of bringing $200 million in funding to New Hampshire that's going to increase uh, jobs but also improve our roads and our bridges. Um, and it was an exciting thing to be working on a new way of financing, and I'm really proud of the work that we've done. We can also work on helping manufacturing with the Make It in America agenda that I'm committed to, um, increase our exports through the Import-Export Bank, and just help small companies grow. That's the backbone to the New Hampshire economy, and it's been great to be a part of it.